Hello everyone, welcome back to Out of the Box Thrift on YouTube. My name is Ren, I'm a part-time reseller, blah, 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 blah. All my exciting stuff is on my main channel, which I can link up here, but I am doing a little bit of a buyout today. It's not a buyout from like another reseller, but I bought a haul from this girl about five months ago and she just had a bunch of stuff, a lot of stuff new with tags, a lot of rave outfits that are really good for resale um, and things like that, just a lot of good stuff. I still have a ton of inventory from her from that haul and I paid only $100. And so she, today she texted me, she said she had more items and so I'm just gonna go and see what she's got. I can put a little thing here of what I got from her, got Kate Spade, Doc Martens, Rave Brands, Dolls Kill, a lot of stuff like that that I already have sold and still am selling from her first haul. So she has some more and I'm gonna go check it out. So you're gonna take you with me. Thrifted outfit of the day. I got this shirt that I'm pretty sure I got at the bins. I love it for a good like Halloween fall look. And then these pants, also pretty sure I got at the bins. Um, so I probably paid like a dollar for each of these, if not less. So I'm not really in the place in my life right now to be bringing more stuff in. In fact, I really need to be moving more stuff out. But the opportunity arose and I feel like I have to take it. She had really good stuff last time and stuff that it moved quickly. Plus, I'm going to be doing my first ever live pop-up event um, in August, so in a couple weeks. And I feel like the kind of stuff that I got from her is going to be really awesome to curate for that type of event. Um, and I'll do a whole video on that when the time comes. But... Um, yeah, I feel like it was kind of like perfect timing. So hopefully it's what I think it's going to be. Hopefully the stuff that she has for me is kind of along those same lines as before. Um, but I think it will be because she has great style. 20 minutes later. Okay, so I didn't want to like film walking into her house. But because I didn't want to be like awkward. And plus she was like letting me into her house. But already off the bat, I don't know. I don't know if it's necessarily going to be as good as the first haul, but I, I also paid another $100 now. The thing is, she does have like brand, here, let me flip the, she does have a lot of like brand new rave clothes. So this is a cute little rave top, brand new. It just came out of the packaging. I don't really know this brand. Um, I Valentine maybe, I don't know. Um, but it has like the matching maybe bottoms or accessories. Um, another brand new, this one is from I Heart Raves. So I could sell this little set. It's brand new, so I can probably get almost what it's worth on the website. Um, and see this one, also brand new, hot and delicious. I don't know that brand either, but it looks pretty cute. Sorry about that ASMR sounds. There is a pair of Timberlands. Um, these are very lightly worn. I mean, there is a little bit of, like, not damage, but lightly worn Timberlands, lightly worn Uggs. I wonder if I could honestly even take these to, like... Put this closet lots of shoes this time i think i literally had these for homecoming one year i should have brought my tripod i'm literally filming this in the car as i'm seeing this stuff for the first time um because by the time i get home the sun might be down and i want to go through this with the raw first time emotions um these brand lovesick i feel like some of this stuff is like not as good as the last time to be completely honest um but like i could probably get a little bit for these these are these are more like mall brands but not necessarily the good mall brands, almost famous, um, wild fable. So like some target brands, a little nervous about spending another hundred, but express Jessica Simpson. Sometimes Jessica Simpson, Simpson shoes do pretty good. I haven't had a lot of success with the other Jessica Simpson stuff, but especially cause these are in like brand new condition. You could tell, um, love sick, but these are kind of cute. I mean, depending on, like some of these stuff style wise is pretty good i just don't know like brand wise see a lot of express but i could probably get if i price this stuff right i can probably get some good deals going oh this looks good okay new with tags garage see but that's the thing this looks like something i would want to keep new with tags garage so this in the timberlands might pay back my it's originally fifty dollars Rock and Republic. Rock and Republic has some cute stuff style-wise um, that sells pretty well. Not for like a lot, but it sells easily. Um, like this is like a Cubs shirt or a Bear shirt, it looks like. Or Vans. Oh, Vans Warped Tour. That's cute. 
So as of right now, it's looking like not as good of a haul as last time, but I did pay the same amount. So I'm interested to see like what I actually will sell through and how much I'll have paid for this lot. When I get home in a minute, I'm going to kind of split this up into a couple piles and say like how many items are sellable, what I think I can get for them, and like um, kind of figure out how much I paid per item. So we'll do that in a few. Okay, this bag, and besides my water bottle, that bag of shoes. Let's go through it. Okay, so after looking at everything, this right here is going to be the donate pile um, out of what I got. The shoes are going to be pretty good. The rave gear here is going to be pretty good. Um, in total, I got like 37 or 38-ish pieces. Um, these ones are my maybes right now. I'm not exactly sure, but it looks like about 38 pieces. Some are new with tags. They have like Fashion Nova and Garage that are new with tags. But um, I don't know. Definitely not as great of a haul as the first time. And I, def and I spent the same amount of money. So... Let's even say it's 38 items. I paid 263 per sellable item. So hopefully I can make all of that back. Um, I guess just stay tuned on this channel to see how I do with that and all the changes and exciting things that are coming in the future because there is a lot. Um, also, you can subscribe to my personal channel. I'll have it in the description below because I do all my travel and music festivals and events down there. But um, I'm gonna try and make some money off of this cute little haul. And until then, uh, keep investing your money, investing in your business, and um, I don't know, do I say something at the end of these videos? I don't remember. <laughs>